Claude Victor Perrin, first Duc de Belluno, the 7th of December 1764 to the 1st of March 1841, was a French soldier and military commander during the French Revolutionary and Napoleonic Wars. He was made a Marshal of France in 1807 by Napoleon. Topic: Life. He was born at La Marque in the Vosges, son of Charles Perrin and wife Marie-Anne Floriot, paternal grandson of Charles Perrin and wife Gabrielle Guerra, born in 1696, and great-grandson of Pierre Perrin and wife Anne Louvier. In 1781 he entered the army as a private soldier, and after ten years' service he received his discharge and settled at Valence. Soon afterwards he joined the local volunteers, and distinguishing himself in the war on the Alpine frontier, in less than a year he had risen to the command of a battalion. In Drome, Valence, on 16 May 1791 he married Jean Josephine Muguet, by whom he had issue which was extinct in the male line by 1917. <laughs> <laughs> Military career The Revolutionary Wars For his bravery at the Siege of Toulon in 1793 he was raised to the rank of General de Brigade. He afterwards served for some time with the Army of the Eastern Pyrenees, and in the Italian campaign of 1796–1799 he so acquitted himself at Mondovi, Rovereto and Mantua that he was promoted to be general of the division. After commanding for some time the forces in the department of Vendée, he was again deployed to Italy, where he performed well in service against the papal troops, and took an important part in the Battle of Marengo. In 1802 he was made governor of the colony of Louisiana for a short time, in 1803 he commanded the Batavian army, and afterwards he acted for 18 months 1805 as French plenipotentiary at Copenhagen. In that year he married for a second time in June at S. Hertogenbosch to Julie Vosch van Avesat by whom he had an only daughter who died unmarried and without issue. The Napoleonic Wars On the outbreak of hostilities with Prussia the War of the Fourth Coalition he joined the Fifth Army Corps under Marshal Jean Lannes as Chief of the General Staff. He distinguished himself at the battles of Saalfeld and Jena, and at Friedland he commanded the First Corps in such a manner that Napoleon made him a Marshal of France. After the Peace of Tilsit, he became Governor of Berlin, and in 1808 he was created Duke of Belluno. The title was extinguished in 1853. In the same year, he was sent to Spain, where he took a prominent part in the Peninsular War, especially against Blake at the Battle of Espinosa, and later at the battles of Talavera, Barossa, and Cadiz, until his appointment in 1812 to a corps command in the invasion of Russia. Here, his most important service was in protecting the retreating army at the crossing of the Berezina River. He took an active part in the wars of 1813 to 1814, until in February 1814 he arrived too late at Montero sur Yon. The result was a scene of violent recrimination and his supersession by the emperor, who transferred his command to Gérard. Thus wounded in his amour propre, Victor now transferred his allegiance to the Bourbon dynasty, and in December 1814 received from Louis XVIII the command of the second military division. In 1815, on the return of Napoleon from exile in Elba Victor accompanied the king to Ghent. The Bourbon Restoration When the Second Restoration followed the Battle of Waterloo he was made a peer of France. He became president of a commission which inquired into the conduct of the officers during the Hundred Days, and dismissed Napoleon's sympathizers. In 1821 he was appointed war minister and held this office for two years. In 1830 he was Major General of the Royal Guard, and after the July Revolution of that year he retired altogether into private life. He died in Paris on 1 March 1841. His papers for the period 1793–1800 have been published Paris, 1846. <laughs> Personal life He married firstly in May 1791 Jean Josephine Muguet and had four children 
Victorini, 1792 to 1822. Charles, 1795 to 1827. Napoleon Victor, 1796 to 1853. Eugene 1799 to 1852. He married secondly in June 1803 Julie Vosch van Avisat 1781 to 1831 and had a daughter. Stephanie Josephine 1805 to 1832. Topic: Evaluation. Victor had mixed military talents. He was an excellent organizer and tactician. During his time in Spain he destroyed entire Spanish armies with canny-like envelopments and even fought Wellington to a virtual tactical draw at Talavera. However he was a timid strategist often afraid of taking risks. Nevertheless, he recognized new developments in warfare and implemented them throughout his career. At the Berezina River in 1812, he made excellent use of reverse slope defenses showing that he learned something from Wellington. 